the Corps introduces a Deputy Commandant for information, the USS Polar is commissioned, and the plan for new rifles, this week on the Corps Report. The Corps established a Deputy Commandant for information recently. Modern warfare challenges the Marine Corps to analyze how information is collected, exchanged, and understood. Commandant of the Marine Corps, General Robert Neller, said, We will have to fight for and with information on the battleground of perceptions and ideas. We can never take our enemies for granted. We will be tested. Lieutenant General Daniel O'Donohue was promoted and assigned as the first Deputy Commandant for information on August 9th. He will pave the way for Marines to adapt and overcome information challenges in modern warfare. The Corps is seeking a single source to field M27 infantry automatic rifles. Marine Corps Systems Command is purchasing the rifles based on feedback from Marines. The M27 outperforms the M4 with a higher volume of fire and longer effective range. The plan is to start fielding M27 rifles in infantry units as early as 2018. Jesse Puller is back where the fight is. The USS Lewis B. Puller was reclassified and commissioned as a warship on August 17th, giving it full capabilities under the law of armed conflict. The ship will be forward deployed in the U.S. Central Command and the 5th Fleet. Commissioning the USS Puller allows the U.S. Navy and Marine Corps to meet the threats of the region head on. That's all for this week on the Corps Report.